Here we have CS300 assignment number three from DigiPen Institute of Technology. This assignment covered bump mapping. Um, first of all, please note that while this main hovering object is bump mapped, the ground plane is not. So if you can see when I look down, it's just perfectly smooth. Anyway, so for the bump mapping, as you can see, it looks like this is a map of the globe with the mountains looking like they're protruding out from it. However, in all actuality, there's no real geometry in there. This object is perfectly smooth. Um, it's perfectly smooth spe sphere. And all I'm doing is using bump mapping, which is just lighting, to fake your eye into thinking that there's a bump there. So if you zoom in, looks kind of plasticky, um, which is what bump mapping kind of bump mapping is supposed to look like that. Kind of plasticky there but like I said looks like it's protruding whereas if you look at the silhouette of the object like over here you'll notice that there are no protrusions it's perfectly spherical or circular in this case so like right here there you go